hip tinkety tonk. <laughs> Shaving thing. I could use a shave. I'll say. Your five o'clock shadow goes clear to your ankles. Hey. Hey, he's a dog. He's covered in hair. Dog. Hey, dog. The skin bodies rule the street. What? <laughs> Wait, did they just fire a little gun? Yes! After him! I mean do I get to do a chase against the little Tally -ho, car? Fool. Yes. Tally ho, fools! Hold on, I gotta do a, I gotta do a small chase scene against the a rats in a tiny little RC car in my regular car. Hang on, I should do a British accent for the rest of this, and I'm not nearly drunk enough. All right, so I need to get in my car, right? Yeah. Actually, hold on, good. Can I just shoot them from here? No. Alright, oh, let's just get in the car. Did they ever fight any lefties? Hey! Yeah. <laughs> the skin body can't be stopped! Oh, they're little RC car, they're just shooting the little gun. After you think they'd shoot the tires? Right? They're just shooting randomly. Drug RC dealer? Oh. That, guy, that, that license plate just says drug dealer? I don't think he can help it. I, I think that he's just like pulling the trigger because he's scared and confused in a mouse. Stab! Oh, it looks like the game crashed for a second there. I got scarred. Yeah, same here. Oh, okay. Let's try talking down again. Stop now, or we will take decisive disciplinary action. Decisive disciplinary action. Well, looks like it's time to shoot that one with the gun. He's just humming the tune. <laughs> hey, come on, just stop, guys. Stop. I don't want to commit to violence. This is a non violent society. Hold on, let's try it one more time. No, no, no. When you honk the horn, you gotta be behind them, remember? Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Hold on. Come on. Move it. Get out of the road. Ah, uh, fine. Oh, yeah, I guess you just gotta kill him. Uh, all they know is violence. Because people are animals and violence is the only thing they understand. <laughs> I'm just shooting randomly. Okay. On tight, little buddy. <laughs> Just like a real police officer. That's not fair. They target their shots on civil. Oh. <laughs> it's sad because we're in America. All right, let me take it back to Bosco because I'm gonna be nice and get dialogue from him. No, nah, man, don't even bother. It looks like I'm already here, though. But I'm pretty sure it's fish tank gravel again. I've had worse. Fish tank gravel? <laughs> I've had worse. It's fish tank gravel. Hey. Hello. We got the rats. Hello, sir. What ho, old bees? What ho? Oh, they don't actually have a thing for it. Oh, Did you, know you what? arrest yet? Oh, well, now that we're here. Hands in the air, Bosco. You're coming with us. Good heavens. What is the meaning of this? We're taking you in for masquerading as a man of class and distinction. Uh, what the devil? <laughs> surely we can. Yes, surely we do. On the bright side, now you can add the police to your long list of paranoia-induced nightmare subjects. <laughs> piss off, piffer, piss off. Thanks, Bosco. Hip, hip, honey nuts. Oh, ask him how much for the thingy. Hello, oh, sir. yeah, yeah. What? I'm sure it'll come in useful eventually. <laughs> for the finale Ooh, of the game. Something. Quite so. The voice modulator. We like that voice modulator. Give us that balloon. Maybe 30 shillings. Yeah, I left our shillings in my other pants. How much in dollars? Let's see. Uh, 30 shillings would be about... <laughs> no, it would American <laughs> Totally. A million bucks? No way are we giving out that many tickets. I think we'll have to find an entirely new revenue stream if we want that voice modulator. Worth every shilling. Trust me, trust me. Yeah, I trust you. Nothing for us right now. Indeed. 
What do you mean it sounded like sarcasm? Thanks, Bosco. <laughs> no, it's fine. Tinkery tonk. Tinkery tonk. Tinkery tonk. The mouse hit me in the conk. Oh, say, tell who. Chip, 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 chip. All right, how are you doing, lunch? It's hello, me, hello, oh, what's boy, all boy. this then? The electrical beast? Pop a cork and buggery. Cheers, love! Where are we going, Sam? The TV, TV studio. studio. So let's agree Goody. to never show Dr. Train Station this episode. <laughs> Alternatively, let's agree to show Dr. Train Station this episode immediately. <laughs> hey, Max. What is it, Sam? Okay, hey, Max. I didn't mean to, talk to, you. Didn't mean to do that. Let's Enough talking, little buddy. Lights, camera, double barreled action. We don't have a double barreled shotgun, though, little buddy. He might. You never know. You don't know what's up his lagomorphic butt. Hello again? Yeah. True. Let's try this again. Can we take another crack at that audition? Fine. Let's take it from the top. Ready, Sam? Show me rabbit. Shave and cream your ass. Cut. Quit stalling I... and act rabbit. I don't know how I could be anymore. I misclicked. You have to be frothing. I misclicked. Now. Come on, I was trying to hit the box. But don't come back until you can froth. It just is a little off. Hello again. Fuck. Yes? It's the finale all over again. Another crack at that nice. Audition? Fine. Let's take Attack it Attack the videotapes. <laughs> how many times did I fucking do that? Attack? The dog! <laughs> attack me! Now that's what I call diseased. Thank no, you. attack me. Thank you. Me, me, me. First off, I'd like to thank all the little people. Who... Zip it. Okay, Max. Good. You just realized your dog is walking death, and you'll have to put him down for the good of society. Really? You're sad. You're despondent. You're grief stricken. Now, show me the emotion. Uh, boo hoo? You call that emotion? I've seen Myra show more emotion, and she ought to be declared a national Botox reserve. Grief, Fuck. I said. Give me grief. Uh... Hmm, I wonder how I do this. I can't figure it out. Give me a hint. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Now. Remember when for like an entire life. episode Despite I just kept shooting that one guy and it was annoying you? Companion out of his misery. No, but I'll take your word for it. Remember, Jesus. Dan, I don't watch your videos, I just Idiot. dislike them all. What demonic force does that make sense. do that? The demonic force called acting, Sam. You should try it sometime. Good thing I had my anti-hypnosis helmet built it's into my head. It's okay, because uh, you guys are better actors what? than the original Bravo. voice actors from the original Such game. Realism. Such authenticity. I was convinced you were actually shooting him. How did you do the sound? I can hear an angry comment right now. I know. The search How did you do the sound effects? By bleeding. Head to the set next door and begin filming immediately. Let's hurry, Sam. We only have 14 minutes and 55 seconds of fame left. 14 Sweet. minutes, 55 seconds. <laughs> Gotta get all that fame in now. All right, people, let's get the stage set up. Celebrity host will be here any minute. Oh, right. The crew is working on Myra. Stupid, no talent, fat face. Yeah. Uh, she seems to really like her. Do you think they hang out? I mean, because it's Hollywood, so Two Face, so yes. Throw. How'd she get here ahead of us? I think um, she just defied the laws of physics. Sorry, you'd be amazed how many times a day I have to do that. Things tend to be hectic here. Doesn't bother oh. us a bit. Okay, I'm glad that they also wondered that question. Yep. Reporting for duty. <laughs> you said duty, Sam. I knew you guys you were said right duty. for the show. Speaking of which, could you perhaps explain the show a bit? Okay, here's the drill. On Midtown Cowboy, you play a pair of cattle ranchers trying to raise a herd in an apartment in Manhattan. My Uncle Larry <laughs> did that, except it was <laughs> pigs. And not in an apartment. I only see one cow. It's a small herd. You're struggling, okay? It's a small herd. Okay. <laughs> You've got this landlord, Mr. Featherly, who has a very strict no cows policy. Devilishly inconvenient. I begin to see I from whence the company. hilarity sprouts. I yes, begin to see from whence the hilarity you sprouts. The fact that you have a cow in the apartment. Lots of side gags. Usually something gross winds up happening. Simple enough. Great. Where's the script? Well, there's a slight hitch. The cow ate most of the script, so you're going to have to ad-lib the show. The cow ad -lib. ate the script. Yes, make it up as you go. Improvise. 
Well, I guess our regular life has given us plenty of practice. Don't worry, you'll be working with Philo Pennyworth, who plays Featherly. He's a brilliant actor, classically trained. Globe Theater and all that. Just set him up to do something funny and he'll handle it from there. Check. Anything else? Actually, yes. We did save one line from the script, and it's really important to work it in, because it's the product placement that pays for the whole show. One of you will have to save the line. Me, me, pick me! All right, <laughs> Max, your line is this. Better get the serious toothpaste. I like it already. Uh, let's start taping. Show about again. It's Max line again. Let's take a break. Let's start We're taping. We're as ready as we're ever gonna be. Yeah. Let's start taping the show. Okay, now remember, your landlord's at the door, and you don't want him to know you've got a cow in there. Ready? Action! We down, cowboy! All right. <laughs> so with what's in the room, how do you hide oh, the cow? I know you're hiding a cow. Uh, a lampshade. Let there be light. Hey. We put a, put a hat on the cow. I know you're there we go. Cow. Life of the party. Shit, how did you know? <laughs> I was... I was thinking with cartoon uh -huh. logic. Also, I, I watch a lot of sitcoms. Well, well, well. Who's your guest, boys? Uh... Uh, a cow wearing a lampshade! <laughs> no. <laughs> the Prince of... Upper Earth. <laughs> He's clearly Abraham, like, a chef, Dan. Our chef. This is the French chef we hired. As funny as it would be to go through the fail state seven times. And, <laughs> and hot, hot, hot. I like mine extra crispy. Oh, 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 a French chef, eh? I love French bread and, and French fries. I went to Gay Paris one time myself, you know? It was back in my army. This chicken was in the army. The Imperial Guard. Sergeant Clucksworthy. Cluckington. Ugh. I'd rather care if it is just a prop. I'm not touching that with my bare hands. Alright. So you can't touch that with your bare hands? Nope. You don't have the, uh, the thing yet. Is it in here somewhere? It's in the house. So we... He's a chef. Spatula. But I gotta find one. Cooking show door? Nope. Plate? Yeah. Can we take five? Oh, for no! heaven's sake. I'm the plate! What? I hit the plate second! Why did you not cancel? Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> 